Welcome to AutoWave. Today we've got a Dolphin XP007. We're going to go through a basic overview of the machine, show you how to calibrate it and cut a blade. So, first thing we're going to do when we get the machine is we're going to put our 2.5mm cutter in and our 2.5mm probe. And what we need to do is set the height of it first. So, what we'll do is pull down on the right hand lever. And we can notice we've set the cutter at a certain distance and you can see the, the lights lit up. Left it up, right, so I'll cut that bit out. So, we've got a cutter inserted and our probe. The cutter we've set at that distance and we can see that the lights lit up at the minute. So we now need to bring our probe down so they're both equal. So if we loosen the Allen key at the back, Let that drop down, tighten it up like it would on the other Dolphin machines and other exhaust key cut machines. You can now see our two lights are lit up. If you're having trouble and the light's not lighting straight away, you can turn this top knob there for just slight adjustment. So I can just slightly adjust it just to get my needles spot on perfect. So that's the height level adjustment complete. So the next thing we need to do is calibrate our clamp. So we're going to get two Hon 66 blades, insert them in, we're going to use our clamp end stops to make sure our blades are in the correct place. So now, now these are both in equal spacing. So first thing we're going to do now is calibrate our X axis. So we're going to pull down our handle till we're on the edge of the blade on the side there. And when it's touching, we're going to rotate this handle clockwise. And what that does is it locks it into position. So we can now see that the right hand light is on, the left hand light is not on. So what we're going to have to do, do is adjust the two screws. So we've got number two and number one. So if we adjust number one and tighten it, you can see that our light is now lit up. So that means that is now calibrated in the correct place. So we'll unscrew this, release the handle. And now we're gonna bring the probe and the cutter up to the tip of the bleed to calibrate the white axis. So pull it forward like that. I'm gonna do the same again. I'm gonna tighten my handle. So now, to make this light in the right position, we can adjust the two screws, number three and number four. So by tightening one one way, one the opposite way, we can get our adjustments forwards and back. This is already calibrated fine, so that was that one complete. So that's basically the machine set up now, ready to go. And that is our blade cut. We just remove them. Just trace the bleed, and all we have to do is just copy it onto the other side. So that's basically the Dolphin XP007 available from AutoWave. Thanks for watching. See you on the next video.